will come down the, down the middle, down the three strides, do a tight left-handed U-turn over the oxa to the parallel and down over the key flow horse first saddle cloth. We need control, we need balance. We don't want to be too fast, but we don't want to make the horse come to a standstill. We've got to keep the horse between hand and leg. We've got to be able to alter each stride if we think we're not correct. One, two, three, that's good. That's good. Ah! Ah! The nervous clutch. Okay, good. Give her a round of applause. Just wait a minute, Zoe. <laughs> Taggy, what happened? Right. She's on about... I didn't notice myself, but she said there was something wrong in this corner. <laughs> what she did, she took everything away from the horse here. She lost her forward going movement, she lost her rhythm. So by the time she came to here, she was tugging on the front end, and tugging, and tugging, and tugging, and then she got to the fence. She had a perfect stride, but the fence was in the wrong place. <laughs> We've got, what we've got to do is when we land over the fence here, on the stride that we land, sit up and balance. So we're, we're sort of doing a half halt here. As soon as we feel the horse come back to us, then we've got to move him forward again. We've got to ride into the corner so the horse is coming forward out of the corner. Now we can sit up, sit against the horse and just judge what a stride is going to be. But the important thing there is, we've got to ride forward into the corner so the horse is taking us forward out of the corner and then we can start to regulate. I think we're just going to do that one more time, Taggy, please. No pressure, but I think everybody will be watching this corner. <laughs> forward. Now sit up. That's better. Change. Good. That's nice. Brilliant. Good.